Okay, so I recently got uh, this little FM radio slash card reader. It actually sounds okay considering its size is like a really small. It's got okay battery life. Um, it depends on if you're listening to the radio or you're using the card reader. The card reader seems to use uh, about half again maybe more power than the radio. The radio seems to be able to go for like two or three hours sometimes. Um, this greatly depends on the volume. Um, the card reader is like uh, an hour or something like that, but we're gonna we're gonna take it apart if I can get into it. Okay, got got my knife. One of my favorite knives. It's my favorite folding knife of all time. If you want a cheap folding knife, this is like by far the best one that you can probably get. Especially considering it's only like 25 bucks, something like that. Hold on. Hard to do this with a camera in front of you. Okay, so this front just peels right off. Um, and I'm, I'm hoping I can just stick that back on. It's like, uh, get some screws. They're just Phillips. Fairly small. I don't think a regular Phillips screwdriver would fit in here. What I'd like to do is remove the uh, stupid flashing LED light It's actually in here. I'm going to actually turn it on. See how it flashes? You think that wouldn't be much of a deal. Not only does it waste power, but um, it looks stupid. And if it's dark out, or your room's not that well lit, it doesn't look good. It really doesn't. It is the most annoying thing. When it starts flashing fast like that, it just irritates you and drives you insane. So... Well, there's the battery. Looks like it's got a 400 milliamp battery in there. It feels like it's a uh, lithium. Is it lithium? Okay, we got some double-sided sticky tape that was holding it on. Maybe. Actually, I don't think any of that was holding it on. It looks like that's holding the LED on. And then this back cover. The speaker would come out. Feels like something's catching. Hold on. All right, so I got this off. As you can see right here is a little. Hold on. Okay, so we got this. And we got the antenna right here. It was just soldered onto there. We got a little wire right here, and it's hot glued right there. And then we got this LED right here, which I am doing away with because that's just freaking irritating. This apparently is a 3 watt, 4 ohm. You can look up that uh, if you want. Let's bring the battery up on here so you can read it. There you go. This is what the inside looks like. This basic stuff, but uh, I'm going to take that uh, antenna. I'm going to maybe drill a small hole in this case and have the uh, little wire run out or something and connect it into anything, really. All right, let's turn that off. Um, I think I'm going to actually take a, because I don't know what these things are called, they're the telescoping or whatever antennas. And you notice it's like really short. It's not even as long as my finger. The whole length of the antenna is like pretty much finger long, if that, because uh, if you look where my opening is, it's like, barely there so it's really small and it, it doesn't perform very well so I think I'm gonna like uh, hot glue a much larger antenna to the side of it and see if that will uh, work or remove this one somehow if I can and stick a bigger one in it because I don't care it's nice that it collapses down to the same length but you know if I got one that'll shove in there that's you know and collapse down it's more like maybe here. 
and then when it goes up, it'll be like really big, you know. Maybe I'll go with that. Okay, so I have it um, hooked up to an antenna now. This is uh, probably 20 inches, and I got it hanging vertically, so it's omnidirectional. Um, it, it would make more sense if you understand antennas to have it vertically when I go to test this. So let's uh, flip it on. Should go to radio, and then I think I hold this down to program. Oh, that's time. Hold that menu, maybe. Not doing anything. Mm. Which one was play? You gotta grab the thing here. Okay, menu, play. Just hold this one down and see what happens. Nothing. Let's hold this one down. I gotta be in radio mode, then hold it down. There we go. Yeah, we had 14 before, and it had a horrible reception. I mean, just downright horrible reception. Yeah, the reception is significantly better, because, I mean, we're up to 21, 22, 23, 24. You can see those. There we go. Let me get... Let's try and get this one out of the way. This is way better. Normally it sounds better with that case on it, but... See, before this station didn't even really come in. Like, it was nothing but static. Same with this station. Nothing but static. Like, it would show up in the scan, but you couldn't hear anything. It was just static. It's kind of more like this. <laughs> this is what it sounded like. This was literally the only station that came in good. Which is, uh, I think it's Family Life Radio. Oh, this is Family Life Radio. This was the one that came in good. There we go. So that's done way better. This is much more an acceptable area. Alright, we can turn it off. Let's see if I can... I'll disconnect the uh, light and see what happens. Let's, uh, let's just turn in. No, not light. I just want nothing. Okay, there we go. They want. I want to see what happens if I disconnect this. I want to grab some cutters. So I don't know if it's gonna work with. It. Let's turn it off first, cause. There. That way I can uh, just cut through this. There you go. Let's get them separated a little bit. All right, let's see if that is still functional. I don't know why it wouldn't be. Oh, I think it seems to work. I could put a card reader in here. But... And when you put a card in there, you can either go to it by uh, using the menu, or I think you just shove it in there like that, and it'll just say read. And yeah, uh, it shows up. And you can flip through them. You can go back to this, which was, should put me on the video. Then we should go with line, and then it goes to nothing, and we go back to the card. Alright. Yeah, this is, this is much nicer to have a 
I mean, this thing's long. I can't check this out. Yeah, how long this is. Just so you get an idea. It's fairly long. I mean, I think I got a 7 inch hand, so 1, 2, 3, so about 20 inches, 21 inches. Around there. Give you an idea here. I'm holding on to the very tip. There you go. Now that's this emerald wire, like maybe 22 gauge. So, uh, basically, I think I think that's just about it. Uh, I'm just going to put some tape over top of that. Um, close it back up. Um, I think I'm going to leave the, the black wire out of there. I'm going to come up with some sort of uh, um, pole that I can raise up and down or attach to it. Maybe I'll hook this back up. And then uh, maybe I'll even 3D print some, some sort of a side mount thing for a larger telescoping uh, type of antenna. So I got the antenna hooked up. And it's actually doing a much better job even with just out the thing on there. So yeah, it's not something you'd want to shove in your pocket anymore, but let's put the cover on here. Oh, stuck to a thing. Oh, it's all messy. Not putting that on there until I get thin. Oh, look at crap my entire life. All right. I gotta have this for my entire life. <laughs> look at that. I guess good reception with the cover on. Huh, Who would have thought? No, I'm just kidding. All right. Ridiculous reason. But yeah, check this antenna out, ladies. You can just extend this right up there. We're gonna do another check. I don't know how many was on here. I was gonna go through them. Okay, so there's 26. Let's put it up vertically like this. I actually don't remember what the old number used to be. Okay, so it looks like it's 28. Oh, I could have just went back the other way that whole time. Okay, so... Yeah, it's 28. So, I think that might be actually... More. Was it 28 before? I don't know if it was or not. But yeah. So far, it's pretty good. But either way, it's way better than 14 and only... Literally only one, sta one station could you listen to. And if you look, I mean, that's how bad that just went. Like, it comes in like crap, so I can extend this. I just break to there. And it starts getting... Yeah, look at that. And that's without the antenna even being all the way up. Look at that. And that's a ways up there. It's probably like uh, 20 inches, somewhere around there. Kind of like what happens sometimes when you're trying to get God's attention about something. No answer. How many Christian radio stations are there? <laughs> Can extend that all the way out. That's really boring music. What even genre is this? I don't even know. Oh, I hate that song right there. Geico presents unhelpful home improvement how to. You can't predict when a pipe will burst, but what? Yeah, see, not too good with all of it like that. If I touch it, it's good. Let's see how far I gotta make it go. That's just a little ways right there. And that's, you an idea? My tips of my fingers are on there. So, it's about elbow long right there. Struggling, let's bring it up just a little bit more. So that's a lot better right there. You can actually listen to it. But, all the way up. Let's take this off right here. There. That's how, uh, how that is. So it's actually pretty good. It's not too crazy. I mean, that's... This table's a little bit below waist high, and it's... Much, uh, hold on, let me get the... I mean, when you it don't have a big marketing budget, you have to wait until the opportunity is just right. Well, you an idea? There we go. What is that? 30? It's about 30 inches. So it's, uh, no, it's like two and a half feet worth of antenna. That's 
pretty decent. That should work pretty good for uh, FM.